Hey YouTube, it's Josh here again from the Dark Dimensional Duelist, and I am here today to show off a deck profile that's very dear to me. I really like it. It's not that competitive, but it's very fun. It can be very bricky sometimes. It's a fun deck to play. This is my Meikashi deck. I like to call it, or refer to it as, the Bone Tower, based on this card right here. I'm going to make your opponent's deck look like a Bone Tower of Sadness. We got my got my main deck here, extra deck and side deck here. Let's move. Let's get started on the main deck for this profile. Starting off, we have one Yasha, the skeletal Mayakashi. We also have one Shafu, the wheeled Mayakashi. Looking very cool. Wish he'd been in secret rare, but nice. Then we have two Daki, the Graceful Mayakashi, the best card in this deck, probably. It's crazy broken, but very restricting as well. And we have three Hajin, the winged Mayakashi. Three of these bad boys. Definitely, definitely need these. It's basically your starter. Then we have three Yuki Mizumi, the Ice Mayakashi. Very nice, three of these ones. And then we have the main big bad boy. Surprisingly, just two soul absorbing bone towers. This is uh it's what's gonna be it's going to make the magic happen. Really, really nice, really fun card just to watch your opponent's soul leave their body as you <laughs> as you use it. Now we have two sheer new solitaires. And two Yuna Zombies. We got two Gazookis. Gotta love the Gazuki. And two very juicy secret rare Mizukis. It's probably one of my favorite zombies. That is all for the monsters. Pretty nice. 20 monsters. Everything's here. It needs to be here. Let's move on to the spells real quick. We got ourselves one, one for one. Very nice. One Foolish Burial, always good. One Reasoning. These are all of our one ofs here. One Monster Born. Very standard, very classic. Search one ofs here. One Day of Peace. One Into the Void. One Upstart Goblin. And then we move straight into the High Risk, High Reward. One of my favorite cards, I love the artwork. Three, Pot of Desires. Love Pot of Desires. Some people hate it, a lot of people hate it. I really like it. I like it mainly for the artwork, but I also like the risk factor when you use it. Three, Mayakashi Return. Very card, absolutely necessary. Sometimes you're Ash Bait. Speaking of ashes, three, Called by the Graves. Gotta have that, call those ashes by the grave. Two, Call of the Mummy. Gotta have that to get your extra normal summon. And then two double summon. This deck kinda requires two double two normal summons sometimes. Sometimes you don't need it, but a lot of times you kinda need it to get this guy on the field. You gotta get him on the field in order to get your combo started. Because that's the whole point of this deck is to mill your opponent to death. And watch their soul disintegrate. That's it for the spells, and that's it for the main deck. Let's move on can, to the extra deck. You can explain more about the cards later when you do combos. Yeah, I'll, I'll be explaining all of these cards when I do a combo video. I'm looking forward to doing that. I'm just doing a quick profile video. Here, let's go to the extra deck. We have... Oh my god, I can't even read this. <laughs> Yuki Oni, the Absolute Zero, Mayakashi. Two of them. Very nice. That's our link four. Very nice. We have three. Yuka Ona. The Ice Mayakashi. Very cool. Three of them. Definitely need three. This entire extra deck is all Mayakashis. We have two. Hold these names. I'm going to butcher these. We have two Oboro Garuma, the Wheeled Mayakashi. Oh my god. My god, I don't know how to do it. Yeah. I like to pronounce these names. They're really cool names. Here we have two Sutragoma, the Poisonous Mayakashis. Very cool. 
I love the artworks in these cards. I'm very appreciative that all these are secret rare. We have two Tengu, the winged Mayakashi. Very cool looking. Then we have two Yoko, the graceful Mayakashi. Very nice. Then finally we have two Gacha Dokoro, the skeletal Mayakashi. Whew. Thank God that's over. There is these Miyakashis. I love these in Secret Rare. And as again, we will explain what these do in the combo tutorial and how they all play with each other. That's what we run in the extra deck. Let's move on to the side deck. Side deck is very spicy. I actually just, just went through it and added something really nice. That's our third bone tower, just in case we need it. Love the bone tower. We got three Dark Roller No Mores. Seen that a lot in a lot of our uh, sad decks. Here's a spicy one. Three drag down to the grave. This deck is very fearful of Nibiru. You could also put in Prohibition, but I don't have any. We have one Pot of Avarice. I could put two more in, but honestly don't know if one is even necessary. It's a good card. It could definitely be used turn one. And if you have the right setup, you could use all three of them in turn one. Which I know kind of sounds crazy to hear. And then you can use card destruction. You know, return to Miller Punch to Death. It's mill their hand even more. Then we have this spicy little tech that I just I know it probably has been out there, but I just discovered it. Three trap tricks and three evenly matches. <laughs> this is when you just don't care what your opponent has on the field. You just trap trick them, evenly match, bada bing, bada boom, then mill them to death and watch their soul evaporate. And that's it for the side deck. Oh, it went pretty fast. Pretty fun though. Uh, catch him right in battle phase, in, in a battle phase. All right, you guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this deck profile of the Mayakashi deck, aka Bone Tower, as I'd like to call it, because of this guy. It was really fun. If you guys liked it, feel free to leave a thumbs up. It's much appreciative, and I'll catch you next time here on the Dark Dimensional Duelist.